Hello again everyone, this is Gilmer and this is episode 2 of my Let's Play Revolution Under Siege Gold. And I, you know, I, I actually did most of my moves for this turn in the last episode, so I'm probably pretty good to go. But I'm just kind of checking it over, making sure there's nothing else I want to do. I got some pretty weak units here. Except for that one. I actually probably should put it under some kind of... I wonder if... Yeah, that, that works because... Without a general, it was at 15%. Now it's uh, at 10%. Uh, and he was already at 10%, I think. But, um, yeah, that made him a nice little better although I wish he was active that's not good but should we buy some units did I buy some units last time finish supply I don't know if I uh, let's put them Finland army no no no, no, no. Wait a minute. Are these... I think I ordered these. Because they don't have a power of anything. There's, I think they're still building. Yeah, we'll be operational in approximately 20 days. Uh, finished supply, finished detachment. There's another one. Finished airport. Well, then who is this? Uh, now that looks like it's just supply. No. Oh. Here we go. The Swedish Brigade. It's them over there. Let's just go ahead and wait a minute. Let's just go ahead and add another supply to them, and then let's lock them. And uh, that'll give us a little bit more power getting down in here. What does it say? It didn't. It's not moving anymore. Okay, what's going on? And then I do that. I grab the map instead of the unit. Why is he not moving? There's some unit in here is... That's, won't that why won't that unit move it doesn't say that it's locked all right well I'm not gonna worry too much about it we're gonna get them down there looks like four days one two three four yep so we'll get them down there we got a okay little force right here and then we got some more coming down 118 power to add to the 164, which would give us 182. No, 282. And then we got 199 here. And then we will have here, we will have total power of about 500. That's not too bad. Not in this little scenario. So let's see. Um... We're doing. We're not doing too well on this. So we we really should try to capture this town, city. This Tampere, Vipuri, Helsinki, and Turku. Turku's over here. Helsinki, 
V. Puri, and then of course we're kind of sieging. I guess we're sieging Tampere right now. So let's go with that. National Morale's at 101. Victory points 23. Engagement points 14. What turn is it? Uh, this scenario will end in early October. We're in early March. So what's that? 7 times 2 is 14 more turns. All right. Let's see what happens. Oh, come on. Okay, here we go. Finish victory. But we lost one. We lost a unit there. And then he's here. Good. Oh, God. The winner. So he's at 220. He's at 233. What is his what are his stats? 5 2 and 1. And his stats are 5 1 and 1. So we could move some units over here actually and it'd probably be better for all concerned. Let's put artillery in there because he didn't have any uh, communication company engineers oh, a grenadier bat battalion oh wait a minute why are we at 35 percent now oh great I didn't think that one through did a So let's move them back. So he's at 5%. He's at 35%. Oh, uh, we, we, we moved those guys too. They're at 30%. He has some units already attached to him. That's part of the problem. I wonder if I could put this guy... No, it makes it 35%. No. That does not work. He's at two twenty one. See what we did there? We took we actually took a a uh, infantry unit out, but he didn't he didn't change his power at hardly at all. He went down to twenty five percent from thirty five percent. This guy's still at 10%. He's at 220. Um, so we're besieging this unit or this city. Tampere is besieged, but the structure is intact. Well. These two divisions probably don't need to merge either. Although they're, they're both at zero. Yeah, there we go. So we were able to merge them, get that to 273 with 0% uh, command penalties. This guy's still up here. I think I am going to bring him down here. I don't think that... I think that city is gonna gonna be lost anytime soon because it's it is 
covered. That's not it. It is surrounded by all of our owned regions. This one's not 100%, but it is 79%. So I'm, I'm okay with that. I don't think they're going to be able to make a sustained drive up through here to get to Coopio. So we'll keep that there. We're going to have him. I wonder if he, what, what is his required command, provided command. So I could probably put that this one in there with him too. Let's look at our messages. So the capital of Soviet Russia is moved to Moscow for safety reasons. Moscow decides to withdraw its remaining troops in Finland. Uh, according to the terms of the Brest-Litovsk Treaty, and after having done their best to delay it as much as possible, the last Russian troops leave the Finnish territory. Finnish Bolsheviks are on their own. Colonel Savezhnikov decides to stay with his Finnish comrades. All right. Uh, our merchant fleet from the... Jamsa Division engaged the Reds in Tampere. And then all these, we won the battle in Tampere. Then we had planes from Vasa flew a recon mass mission in Vasa on day three. So these units will be operational in about five days, which is the next turn. This Finland army, it is locked for now. We can move this to there. Maybe they will fly missions in this area. Leader, leader, regular artillery supply. I don't think we have too much to worry about from them. So... If I bring this guy down, wow, there's four units. I wonder what, what kind of units they could be. Let's let's see what kind of see if we can't rec reconnoiter what's in Vipuri. I got four units there, but they might be really bad units. Like four militia. All right. What else? Uh, Javaskala division has arrived in McKelly at day three. Okay, that's that. Swedish brigade arrived in Tampere. That was that. That was uh, this guy. Your control of Turku has been re reduced from to zero at day 15. That's here. That's the city we were unable to defend, so we let it go. H.O. Uh, Hamarsen, Hialmarsen, has been congratulated for his actions against the enemy, New Seniority 104. So the, the message are pretty sparse at this point. Um probably going to be that way pretty much this whole scenario to be honest with you oh, let's proceed to the next turn what is this is that another one of those trains with a gun on it but surely he can't what is that So how did he get supply in there? So 
So we got 15 red guards unit, 14th red guards unit, 4th red guards unit, a garrison, and a Vipuri force. And we got the Karelia mounted Jaegers. I'm just going to bring them down there. Let's see if we can't. Yes. So, uh, no. We have no command point penalties to combine those. For combining those. Let's take a look at this. So I, if I come down here, seven days, if I do this, why is it, oh, it's because of, I was about to say, why does that always sound like I'm on the railroad tracks when I'm not? But it's because I have this, uh, Siege weapon, siege guns on a on a rail car thing, the savior of Corellia. Makes sense, I guess. I'm not going to assault this city because it says that the structure is intact, even though it doesn't look like it really has any walls. I'm gonna wait till it says it is completely. Uh, the the walls are completely okay. See, that's good. Let's move them down here too. Once it once it, I get this message to say, you know, breach one. The walls are completely bes uh, breached. Uh, there is no defensive bonus for the defenders. Then that's when I'll I'll make my attack. Let's see, what else can we do? Can we build some more units? Siege artillery. That's something that we might want to do. Engineers. White, white guards. One art, 105 artillery, 105. That says 105 as well, but this is a this is a howitzer. That's a regiment. Right. It's or a couple. Of them. So let's see. I'm not really sure if this is, hold on a second, <laughs> not really sure if this was outside the city, it sure does look like it is, and then this is a artillery piece, I think, that's on, set on rails, similar to my savior of Corellia. On day 14, we in, intercepted an enemy air, airplane formation attempting to perform an air recon mission in Tampere. Main enemy fought. Reds, we lost five airplanes and shot down seven. We lost one and shot down zero. We lost six and shot down four. So that's not necessarily all that good. Uh, three brigades of Finnish Jaegers are available at Vasa. Okay. So that can be moved. That is good to know. Fin Detachment. They're the ones on the rail. They're still on the rail. This is still locked. Jaeger Reinforcement. That is nice. 307 and doesn't even have a, a general. These are all the ones I just purchased. And we just looked at all of that. Hagland Division. Yeah. Finland Air Force. Jiviskala. Jiviskala. 
sort of valve division has arrived in Lapina Renta. He guesses as good as mine. Uh, training of the white guards is finished or nearly finished. Finish supply. Maybe that's why it was locked. So anyway, the messages are, again are not real earth shattering to be honest. We still own We militarily, no, they have the military control. We have the loyalty, though. I wish it would show military control. This is military control, 67%. If I could get this to surrender, that would be huge. All right. Uh, let's see. They've lost thirty-three eighty. We've lost forty-seven thirty-five. That's not too good, is it? They got three of those things. That's the way. Nice. Finish victory. that he's down to 121 though and he's back up to 134 137 add him Oh, we've taken Tampere. Yep. Don Cossack, Don Cossacks, Cossacks uprising. Faced with countless exactions from the retreating Reds in the Ukraine, the Germans are advancing. The Don Cossacks rise up in revolt once more. Okay. Okay. While taking Tampere, we managed to capture zero supply carts and 21 crates of ammunition. We gained control of Tampere. Thirty five per cent. I really need somebody in charge of them. Still thirty five per cent, but they're at four twenty nine now. He's a five one one. We got to keep somebody in here.
we're going to leave the JAMSA division in there. I think we're going to come down here with most of our most of our troops come to Helsinki and then try to move across and maybe help this guy. Actually, I'm going to get him the hell out of there. Because I, I, I can almost guarantee you that he's going to get beat at some, time, at some point. And I do... What is that? I don't remember that. No, I don't remember that at all. We'll take him, we'll put him, we'll move him up there. We'll put him on. I don't know if there's any units there. And this guy, this guy is inactive. So I don't know if I could get him. Okay. Oh, that's that's got a rail. That's why. So since I can do that, let's do this. Get him back to Sort Valla. Um, inner structure. What is he gonna do? See, I can't tell. What's going on in this in this area? I'm gonna leave him here because he's sitting on a junction of three rails. And I don't want anybody to come from here to go up this way, and I don't want anybody from here to go this way. So, we will focus our attention on these guys for now. We don't have many turns left. Victory points total 71. Victory points total 66. We're at plus 14 per turn. They're plus 7 per turn. So we'll be beating them, them in this next turn, hopefully. And this is going to be the last turn of this episode. Let's see what happens. Look at that. How did he get up there so fast? And he's already coming around through here. Okay, so our... I'm pro did it was it 36 last turn okay what about him he is still holy crap that is insanity. Although technically, that's about, what is that, 283? So that's 700 there. So that would give us uh, 750 something or so. 
How can we beat that? Is this iced over? Is that part of the problem? Oh, he can come up through here and get to there. That's what he did. But I... I that's pretty interesting. That he's able to get in there so quickly. Get through there so quickly. Oh boy. That scares me right there. I mean, I really shouldn't say scares me. That concerns me. Armored trains. How many armored trains do they have? <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, we lost six airplanes, lost one, uh, shot down one. Germany intervenes in Switzerland. At the request of the Finnish government, the Reich sends a division and a brigade to assist the whites. The Expeditionary Corps is led by General von der Goltz. The German intervention will be will decisively alter the balance, but there is a risk for the young uh, for the young Finnish nation to become a German satellite. So that means when is this going to be ready? Is it ready now? Wait a minute. Has arrived, has arrived, has arrived. Jamsa Division received the 10th Militia. I haven't even begun to look at this. Okay. These are still under production. Reds captured McKelly and Regent McKelly. So. That's. That's the division that we were looking for. I don't want him to go that way. Oh boy. So he has to cross a river to attack me. So that gives us an advantage there if he wants to attack. Although this guy's inactive. This guy looks like he's active. All right. Well, I think that's going to be the end of the episode. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, this is starting to get a little nerve-wracking. Because that guy right there, what if he decides to come this way? Of course, then I could take Helsinki. Helsinki. The harbor is blockaded because I think this is frozen. Are these on my side? Oh, crap. What about all this stuff? Okay, no, I can't. I guess I can't recruit Germans and bring them up here. I wouldn't be able to go through Soviet Union territory anyway. But maybe I could ferry them. All right. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time.